Hello everybody and welcome to one of our how-to guides. Thank you for joining us today. We're going to create an arrangement in a painted pumpkin. So the ingredients that I'm using today, we've got a, a lovely glass vase here which is a 20 by 10 centimetre cylinder which we've placed into our pumpkin which we've painted white. We have some scabious stellata, we have some astilbe pool garter, we have some pampas grass, some absolutely beautiful amnesia roses, some pink heather and some preserved eucalyptus nicolii and some eucalyptus cinerea. So, enjoy! Hope you've enjoyed our painted pumpkin arrangement I hope it's inspired you to have a go yourselves I have a few top tips for you if you're planning to create this yourselves paint the pumpkin in advance and allow it to dry then you won't get any color transference on your hands second top tip cut the pumpkin to the correct size of your vase so I would suggest possibly measuring um, the hole that you need to create with the vase beforehand. Third top tip, you can make this up a couple of three days in advance and store it somewhere nice and cool um, and dark 
so that it, it uh, will last quite happily uh, for your event. If you are using preserved items, obviously they have a really nice long life spell, so you don't need to worry about that. Fourth top tip, if you do cut the pumpkin a little bit wider than it needs to be for the vase that you're using, you could just tuck some pieces of preserved foliage in between the vase and the pumpkin, uh, just to stop the vase from wriggling and moving about in transit. All right, and then my last top tip is you don't have to stick to a pumpkin to use this style of arrangement. It's actually suitable for any type of receptacle. So you could use um, an urn, you could use a jug, a galvanised bucket, or even just a glass vase. So you can then tone it to whatever the season is and whatever your event is. So a really, really popular style arrangement. So this probably just creates a modern twist for a Halloween party or home entertaining, or even for a wedding. <laughs> I hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching us today. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for inspirational designs, tips and guidance. We look forward to welcoming you back again very soon. Bye for now.